Hello everyone. We are looking at Jesus and how he went through uh, the most difficult experience that is the cross and we are receiving uh, or drawing our encouragement from what he has done so that we can live our lives as overcomers and uh, carry that don't quit attitude. Uh, once again looking at Hebrews 12, you know the passage uh, where we um, read about the fact that we must hold on to our focus and fulfill the purpose of god for us uh, we once again see there that we are told to look at the life of jesus now why should we look at the life of jesus no in um, in fact verse 3 we are told for consider him who endured such hostility from sinners against himself lest you become weary and discouraged in your souls you have not yet resisted to bloodshed striving against sin and you have forgotten the exhortation which speaks to you as to sons now uh, there are many things spoken ahead of this you know we see how one must have focus one must get rid of um uh, 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 things that could slow us down like you know sin or um uh, any sort of a disobedience anything at all that uh, is not aligned to the the nature of god we get rid of those things we keep our focus upon the lord and here is another um, uh, thing for us to focus on the fact that the lord jesus was somebody who endured um so many things that we are familiar with just in what i read we see that he endured hostility um then he um you know went through temptation he went through temptation striving against sin so when we go through similar challenges you know sometimes we could ask the question that you know uh, does god know does god understand uh, uh, how how can you know uh, god even realize you know, what experiences i'm going through but here is the reality for us you know god became man and jesus experienced nearly everything everything that you and i could possibly experienced experience in our lifetime whether that's opposition rejection pain hurt a sorrow uh, even positive things joy um, and we see here particularly temptation temptation yes we could be tempted about something different from the times of jesus but you know the way jesus resisted temptation we know that you know he underwent very difficult temptation even in the garden of gethsemane he was tempted to give up and he endured it to an extent where he was shedding blood you know so to that extent he knows the meaning of temptation so we have a wonderful example of an overcomer you know who was hurt by people and yet you know he carried uh goodness in his heart for others forgiveness for others people who spoke evil about him but you know he says father forgive them they don't know what they are doing you know, we see uh, somebody who stands against the wicked works of the evil one all the schemes of the devil he defeated in his lifetime so if jesus could leave behind that kind of an example for us it is really an encouragement to tell us that we too can do it so let's keep our eyes on jesus because we too are overcomers let's pray together heavenly father we thank you for the example of jesus lord the way he overcame so many situations in his life father we pray that each one of us lord will will um, overcome and that lord we will be victorious father because you've already conquered uh the enemy on the cross we give you thanks and praise in Jesus name we pray amen thank you for tuning in to living supernaturally for more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk please visit apcwo.org